so excited to start filming this video because I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing a bunch of slimes that I bought from like Instagram slash Etsy slime shops. So I have got all these slime packages and I ordered this slime, I can't even remember when, I think it was a couple of weeks ago now, so I can't even remember what I ordered, which is super exciting because it's like a present to myself because I have no idea what's inside these boxes. But I'm pretty sure from memory I ordered like a lot of slimes and they're like super heavy, so I think there's a lot in there. So I'm super excited to start opening up the packages and hopefully there's gonna be some super awesome and amazing slime inside. If you're excited for today's video, and you love watching slime review videos just as much as I do then you can go ahead and give this video a massive a thumbs up to let me know. Now if this is my first video that you're seeing then hi my name is Jillian and I'm so so excited that you found my channel and if you would like to see more videos from me in the future and you haven't already subscribed then just go ahead and click the red subscribe button and then whenever I upload a new video you'll be able to see it. So I am way too excited to start filming this video. I've been wanting to just like rip open these boxes for so long but I knew I had to get my first impressions on camera so yeah, I'm finally filming the video. I'm so excited and let's start opening them. So I think I'm gonna start with these three little ones and I'm pretty sure these are all from the same slime shop. Yeah, they are. So this is from Slime Clouds. Okay, so I think in total there is six slimes here, two in each box and oh, which one should I start with? I don't know. Let's start with the one in the middle. So this has cookie dough, butter slime and a fluffy pastel slime in here. So I'm just gonna carefully open this box and I've also got some borax activator mixture sitting here just in case some of these slimes are a little bit sticky I can add a little bit of my own activator. Oh no! Uh, one of the slimes leaked. I'm so glad it was in like a little Ziploc bag because it has just gone everywhere. So I think this is the fluffy pastel slime. Oh no that makes me so sad. So there's also a little sachet of borax in here. I feel like this is trick or treat slime because it's orange, but it says in this box it's supposed to be fluffy pastel slime and a cookie dough butter slime, but I don't know if that's a cookie dough butter slime. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up the other two boxes and then I can match up all the slimes with the names so I can get it right. So I'm just going to open up these now and see what's in them. Okay, so in here, this one looks like it is the char it just says charcoal black. So I'm not sure if this was a butter slime. I'm pretty sure it may have been. And then we've got this green one, and I'm assuming this is sour lime butter slime. And then I'm just gonna open the last box as well. And then in here we have this one, and this one is Trix cereal slime. And then, okay, so here is the trick or treat slime. So it's the orange one. So I'm guessing this one from the per first package is the cookie dough what, butter slime. I don't know, I feel like that's kind of an interesting colored cookie dough. I don't know. We'll see. We'll open them up and we'll have a look. So I'm pretty sure these are four ounce slimes. Those are the ones I picked up. And it just has the little slime clouds logo on the top. And then it's just in this little plastic container and it's got a bit of sticky tape holding it down. Alrighty, here we go. Okay. Oh yeah, this is definitely like a cookie dough texture. Just picking up this slime and it doesn't feel too sticky, which I love. It actually kind of feels perfect, so I don't feel like I have to add any more activator. So I'm not sure if this is scented. I mean like it has, oh it's like dropping these everywhere. It has like a little bit of a scent. But it's like not a super strong scent, it just smells like really sweet. The chocolate chips in the cookie dough, she's used like these little beads that are like hollow and circular. But I feel like the slime is having a hard time holding on to the beads, they just keep dropping out. But that's okay, I'll just keep adding them back in. It's really soft. See, if, did you see that? Like I'm dropping all these beads. Ah, I'm going to have to pick all those back up. But yeah, I'm happy with this slime, I'm excited to move on to the next one. So I'm going to put this one back and let's keep going. Next, I'm going to play around with this one, and this is the Trick or Treat Slime. I'm pretty sure that was what it was called. Where is it? Yes, this is a Trick or Treat Slime, and I bought these around Halloween, so that's why it's like a Halloween-themed slime, and I thought it looked so cool, and I definitely had to pick 
up like a Halloween thing slime. I'm not sure what texture this slime is going to be, but looking at it at the moment, I can see that it's got like black glitter in it and little foam beads. So opening up the trick or treat slime. So it doesn't feel super sticky, which I like. I feel like they activate their slimes like the perfect amount, which is awesome because they have to get to me all the way over here in Australia and for them to arrive like not sticky is like really cool. Oh, oh my gosh, that like scared me. It's got, what is that? Is that like a little fake spider? Or it's like a little fake moth in here that scared me so much. It's got like a little fake bug in here, which makes sense because it's like a Halloween slime, but I did not know that that was going to be in here. This is just a really fun slime for Halloween. I like the idea behind it. I think it looks really cool with the black glitter in like the orange slime. What one should we do next? I think I'm gonna go with this green one and I'm pretty sure this one is the Sour Lime Butter Slime. So this is gonna be a butter slime and I'm assuming it's gonna be a, like sour lime scented. <laughs> Ooh. This one doesn't smell like anything. So I'm guessing it wasn't sour lime scented. Maybe it's just off like the color that it is. And oh my gosh, this is like such an interesting texture. I don't know how I got this one like so perfectly activated. Like it's literally not sticky at all. If anything, it might be just a touch overactivated, but I don't know how they did that. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> over this fluffy pastel slime because it is just a complete mess in there and I just, I don't know, I don't really want to open it. So I'm just going to skip over that one and I'm going to move on to this one and this is a charcoal black and I think this must be a butter slime, I'm not sure. So opening up the slime, oh, <laughs> okay. So this is like a black butter slime, again it's not scented at all and yeah, it's a really awesome texture. Alright, this one I noticed also has leaked a little bit as well. And this is the Trix Cereal Slime. So I'm just going to be super careful when I open it up. And I'm so glad she put them in these little bags. Because if they'd leaked just in the box, they would have gone everywhere. So this is the Trix Cereal cereal slime so this looks like it's a really glossy slime I, oh my gosh I think this may be my favorite slime in this whole slime package it's really glossy it's really smooth and it's got the large flown beads to look like tricks cereal and they feel really cool in the slime So that is all slimes I picked up from Slime Clouds and now moving right along I think I'm going to go with this box next and this one is from Peachy Slime Bakery. Ooh, oh my gosh these slimes look amazing. I am so excited. Ooh, so this is what it looks like when you first open up the box. Now it doesn't say what these slimes are so I'm going to try and find my like invoice from when I ordered them online. Hopefully on there it will have what slimes I ordered. <laughs> All right, I think I figured it out. Maybe, I mean, I could be totally wrong, but I'm gonna start with this awesome purple looking one. And I'm pretty sure this is a blueberry smoothie slime. I really love when slime companies use these like super sturdy containers, like the really, really like durable ones. I love those. So on top, we just had the peachy slime bakery logo. And now I'm just gonna open it up. Ooh, I'm so excited for these slimes. Oh my gosh. Ooh. So I think, yeah, this one is like super sticky, but that's okay because I'll just add some of my own activator. So I'm just gonna do that and I'll be right back. So now it's kind of sticky, which I like, and it's a really pretty like lilac-y purple color, and it's just got a little bit of black glitter in it. it smells really sweet, which I like, and I think this is kind of like a glossy slime. I'm not sure, but I really love the texture of it. Oh my gosh. trying 
out this one and I'm pretty sure this is the mint chocolate chip flow and it definitely looks like it's going to be a really awesome texture. I hope this one smells. Oh yeah, it does smell. It smells like mint chocolate. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So this is a flow and I can already tell. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. I love the smell of mint and fun fact, mint chocolate chip is my favorite flavor of ice cream. So I'm just gonna give this a little mix because the foam beads have separated because it's been sitting in a container for a little bit. Oh my gosh, I love the texture of this one so much. It feels, oh my gosh, what is this? No way, there's a little charm in here, oh my gosh. There's a little Oreo charm in here that is so cute. I love little charms like that and the little extras in slime. That just makes me so happy. Oh, that's so cute. But this one has like got so many flowing beads in it and it's so cool and I'm obsessed. Oh my gosh, and my whole room smells like mint. Oh, this is amazing. To this one and I think this is the banana split sundae slime and this is going to be a banana scented Ooh. oh yeah that does smell like banana so this is a glossy looking slime again and this time it's got rainbow flown beads in it and it's scented like a banana which I love I love the artificial banana scents I'm just gonna add a little bit of borax to this because oh dear it's going everywhere because as you can see it's a bit sticky and I'm getting in quite a mess so I'm just gonna add a little bit of activator and I'll be right back. So this is the banana split slime and like I said it has that really lovely artificial banana scent which I do love. Mmm it smells so good and yeah it's a really nice slime really soft really stretchy it still is a bit sticky I probably need to add a touch more activator. Mm, it smells so good. <laughs> I'm obsessed with slimes that smell good. Next, I'm going to be trying out this green one, and this one is Melon Boba Slime. So I'm just going to open this one up, and this one is going to be scented, so that's exciting. Ooh, that smells, oh my gosh. Oh, that smells delicious. I love that. <laughs> so this is a green, really nice and soft, glossy slime, and it's got some little black flown beads, which, because it's Melon Boba Slime, that's why. So this is the Melon Boba Slime. I think I'm saying that right. I'm not sure. But this one's really nicely, lightly scented. It's just a really nice, like, fresh fragrance, which I really like. And I love the texture of the little flown beads, and yeah, I really like this slime. It's really nice. It's super stretchy, and it's, like, really soft feeling, which I always like. Alright, now the last slime from Peachy Slime Bakery. Ooh, this looks like it's gonna be a lot of fun. This is the Pink Lemonade Slime, and it looks like it's got like yellow and pink flown beads, which look awesome. They're like neon. Oh my gosh, I love the color of these flown beads together. They look awesome. They're so bright. Oh, I love that. And I love the bright pops of pink in this slime, along with the yellow. I I just think this looks so awesome. This is probably one of my favorite slimes so far. Like the texture is really cool. It's really like smooth and yeah, I love it. Okay, it is time to move on to the last slime box. This one is super heavy, so I'm curious as to how many I ordered. But this is from Slime New York. Okay, so opening up this slime box, and it's like super well packaged. There's like protective stuff in here, which I like, so none of the slimes have gotten crushed or anything like that. Ooh, oh my gosh, how much did I order? <laughs> oh my gosh, how many slimes are in here? Oh my gosh. <laughs> So in here first there's just a few little extras and oh my gosh, I'm going to count how many slimes I ordered, hang on. So we have got one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven slimes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh, this one looks awesome. I'm so excited. Woo! This is 
cool. I am so excited. Okay, this is Moon Rock Slime and it's like a really deep purple slime and it's got little bits of glitter in the bottom and it's got some white flown beads and this totally reminds me of Space, which I think might be the idea because it's called Moon Rock Slime. Oh my gosh, let's open it. Oh my gosh, they even put like small and like large and like all different sizes of flown beads in here. Like a lot of work has gone into this slime. Oh, I'm so excited for this slime. Oh wow, it totally is giving me Space vibes. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with this. Seriously, I never thought to add like heaps of different sizes of flown beads, but it's given it the most awesome texture. All right, next I'm gonna check out one of these little ones. And this one looks like it's gonna be so fun. I can already see that it's pink. So I'm already getting like really excited. This one is called Wrapped in Gold and oh my gosh, it's stunning. So yeah, this is the Wrapped in Gold slime. Oh my gosh, the gold flakes are so pretty. You don't even want to touch it because it's so pretty. Ooh, oh my god, I love that. It's not sticky. Oh, that is perfect. Oh my gosh, this slime is amazing like it's perfect okay that is that is so cool that is probably my favorite slime so far it is just like perfect it's pink and gold and sparkly and just awesome well this one is an awesome color it's like a bright turquoisey blue green so this one is a mermaid's tail and I can totally see where they got the name from because it's definitely this aqua like mermaid color and then it's got bits of bluish greenish glitter at the bottom. Glitter totally reminds me of like mermaid scales on like a mermaid tail. These are like the perfect clear slimes. You guys remember how I was saying in my slime Q&A that I cannot make clear slime? Well these people have like, they've got it down pat. This is awesome. Oh my gosh. Next, I'm going to be opening this one, and this one is a purple, and it is Floofy Purple Fuzz. Floofy, Floofy, Floofy. <laughs> okay, let's open this one up. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Whoa, this texture is, oh my gosh, it's amazing. Oh my gosh. What is this? Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. Kind of reminds me of like a spider web. That is so cool. Oh my gosh, it smells like lavender. Mm, it smells really good. I just have no words for how awesome this is. I'm loving this slime package so much. Like they all just keep getting better and better. I'm having so much fun. Okay, next we have this blue one and this is Candy Shop and it's blue with like a flown beads in it. Ooh, oh my gosh, that smells amazing. Oh, it smells so good, it's so like refreshing. Ooh, that smells so, it smells like summer. <laughs> so this looks like a glossy based slime with different size flown beads. So it's got like small ones and large ones to give it a really awesome texture. It also smells amazing. I'm obsessed with it and it's just literally like the prettiest shade of blue. It's like that really pretty light cornflower blue which I love. Oh my gosh, this looks awesome. What is this one? It's like bright orange. So this one is called Lemon Star, and it's like this really bright orange, it looks like a clearish slime on the bottom with lots of white flown beads. Oh my gosh, it smells like citrus, I love it. So it's got this orange clear slime, which has separated because the flown beads, of course, have risen to the top, so I'm just gonna mix it back together. It's 
smells like citrus. I love it so much. And it feels like a flome and yeah, really nice slime. I like this one. Okay, next I'm gonna grab this one and this is a another really pretty pink one. So this is a slushy slime and this is a Barbie pink slushy. And it totally goes with my nails. So this is, oh my gosh, I know I'm gonna love this one just because of the name. So this is a slushy slime. So it's just got these acrylic beads in it. Ooh, I love this. I haven't had a slime today like this texture. It's not scented and I totally just got that on my nose, but it's not scented, but it is like the prettiest pink and I love that it like matches my nails. <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay, moving on. Next, I'm gonna grab this one, and this is another pink slime. I think I ordered a lot of pink slime from this slime shop. Oh my gosh, this one has amazing looking glitter. So this is pink sugar scrub. Can you see the glitter that's in the bottom of this one? Okay, if pink had a scent, this would be it. Like if the color pink had a scent, this would be what it would smell like. Oh, this is so pretty. It's got like little bits of glitter. And it does totally remind me of like a sugar scrub. Oh, I love this one too, a Slime New York. I am obsessed with you. Alrighty, next we have this little one and this is called Gold Digger. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, that gold glitter. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, the clear slimes that Slime New York makes are so good. Like, I don't feel like I need to add any activator or anything. They're just perfect. Oh my gosh, this one's stunning. That gold glitter that they use is just so sparkly. Next, we've got, surprise, surprise, another pink slime. This, oh, oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so pretty. This is called Pink Jellyfish Blob. And I don't know if I'm gonna be able to pick up on camera how pretty this is, but it's like lightly colored pink clear slime. And then it's got little bits of glitter throughout it. And it is just so pretty to look at. And then when you move it around, the like glitter changes color. This one is so pretty. And it like reminds me of a fairy. Oh my gosh, you guys, we are on to the last slime and this totally looks like it's like candy floss or something, like fairy floss. What is it? It is cotton candy squish. And I knew it was gonna be cotton candy because I can see that it was like two-toned through the bubble wrap. So it's pink and blue. Ooh, that is not the texture I was expecting. Ooh, that is such an awesome texture. I don't wanna mix the two colors together. Okay, I'm not gonna play around with this one a whole lot because I hate mixing the colors together and it looks so pretty as it is. But again, I love the texture of it. It's not sticky at all. They like did the perfect amount of activating in all these slimes. This is such a cool texture. I love the colors of the pink and blue together as well. You guys know I love cotton candy slimes, so I'm impressed with this one. Oh my gosh, Slime New York, you are amazing at making slime. I was a bit nervous when I opened up the package and saw how many slimes I ordered because like, what if they weren't any good and I ordered so many, but they were all perfect. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to keep playing with these. That is the end of this slime review. Let me know in the comments below if you enjoyed this video. And also, let me know in the comments below if you think that there's any Etsy slime shops or any Instagram slime shops that I need to check out. If you enjoyed this video, you can let me know by giving it a massive thumbs up. And if you haven't yet, don't forget to click the subscribe button for more videos. Thank you so much for watching. I love you so, so much. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye! Losing focus, breaking up from our life as we know